some more. All right. Say hello to people. Hello. Tell them what you're going to show them. I'm going to show you my ocean box I made in the co-op I went to. This is it. This is a marine flatworm. And it kind of likes to disguise as a nudibranch sometimes so that people can't eat it like this pinniped can. And hmm, these are two crabs now fighting because sometimes crabs fight for our territory. Behind them is a feather cell. And it, it's a climbinoid, but it's kind of like a sea star. And this is a clam with a pollen side because sometimes they make layoffs and layoffs of sand, and then they dry up and make something off off at some time, and they make a pop. This is a ray. And what is this behind it with all the wonderful colors? Yes. This is a coral reef. Mm -hmm. And this is a loggerhead tongue. It's 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 a loggerhead tongue because it has a huge head. Mm -hmm. And this is a beluga whale. Because it got its name, because beluga means white one in Russian. And now for the pinnipeds, this is um, my favorite ocean pinniped that I made. And I named him Sammy. And some pinnipeds like to go on rocks, but they eat green flatworms sometimes. And this is a walrus on top here. And that's another pinniped. That's Sammy's twin, Sally. And, oh yes. These two dolphins are swimming in a pod. A pod is a whole cluster of dolphins because they travel together. And, mm-hmm. And this is a seahorse. It can go. It can, this one can go. Oh, look at that. So clever. And this is a fish that can turn into a male if one of the males in the school of fish dies. <laughs> Wowzers. <gasps> and these are some other whales. This one is the killer whale or an orca. So these guys should probably be running away from the orca. Because orcas like to snack on dolphins. And this is... Humpback will, but for some reason they didn't add the hump on it. But you can tell because of these stripes on the bottom of it here. Great. Yeah. Okay. Say goodbye to your friends. Bye. Bye. Bye.